Hey Mohit, this is Dusty over at German Auto. I just want to go over some things. Uh, we were doing the repair for the uh, auxiliary fan control unit, and when you do that, you actually have to cut uh, the actual wires going to each indiv individual fans. They're not plugged in. Um, we did check them before we put that control unit on it because sometimes these uh, can, they can go bad due to the fact that the, the fans do short out. And luckily, we did catch this. Um, I am uh, just powered up manually, full blast. If you look real closely, you'll see sparks uh, down by the fan. You just kind of see them like just pattering away. That fan is starting to short out. So you see a little tiny flicker. That's from uh, the fan on its way out. So this is what caused the fan control unit to fail in the first place. We want to try to replace that fan. Uh, it's better to do both because it's, uh, it's a little bit of labor to get apart. Um, so I'd recommend we do both engine fans just so we have everything taken care of. Um, we just actually had an A4 come in that we did this exact repair last year and we only did one fan and the other fan has failed. So I would recommend that we do both just to make sure that you don't have to worry about this later on. So hope this helps and explain and kind of see what's going on with your car and then uh, let us know what you want to do. Thanks Mohit.